in this in this video we are going to go and um, demonstrate how how we use the period and the category filters these two can be used in conjunction with each other in this case I'm going to go to the demo budget because there's lots of information and we go to filters now in the filters we will first we will go to the period filters and let's say that we want all information for this year it's already filtered it so we go to between we will apply this and we have got our filters so if we now go to reports and we generate our report we will get on date it's filtered on date between the first of the first of this year and today's current date is the 11th of August so it'll, it'll filter it for this year so far to date and there it all is and as you can see the income versus the expenses has given us a balance of 5,000 for last year we had an income of 8,174 units expenses of 2,788 and 55 cents and our, as I said before the overall running balance is always given to at the bottom of the report if we go to filters and we go to the period filters We, we, we've applied that it's fine. If we go to filters and we'll go to the user defined filters, this is very good because now we can say show me the commission plus the entertainment plus the groceries plus the car payment. And we filter it on, on that and at the very top you can see car payment or commission or entertainment or groceries. If we go to the grid, those are the only entries that will appear in our grid and if we go to our reports and we generate our report at the very top it will tell us on car payment or commission or entertainment or on groceries and of course that's all that gets shown into there and we can see exactly how much it was given to us now if we go to filters and we go to period filters and we say this year and we say apply it has put the filter in for us now there's a little box here check to use with other filters so if I say OK and I go back to my standard filters I go to my user defined filters and I say bonus plus salary plus tips for last year and I say there it tells me bonus or salary or tips and the date is between the 1st of January and the current date today is the 11th of August. If I now go to my grid, it'll tell me everything about that and how much I got at the bottom. was I was sitting with a positive balance of last year after uh, my, of my income of 7,000. I earned 7,000. Well, I got money in 7,134.36. And if I go to my reports and I generate my report, it's giving me everything and on the date between. So on bonus or salary or tips and the date between. Very powerful stuff. That is how you can use your user-defined filters and your period filters and the period filters and the user-defined filters in conjunction with each other. Thank you.